Hello. What you could see right here, it's a uh, classical use on the Kaginawa. It's the rope with a hook. What we have seen here, it's uh, the employment, the usage of uh, of this kind of uh, of classical weapon. That it's a combination of a rope with a hook. Here we have set up something in order to show you how violent the employment of this kind of uh, special technique of throwing the uh, throwing the, the hook it could be because the purpose here is to throw wide, to throw long uh, the hook in order to restrain, to, to take not only the ropes because we have here a classical, a typical wagi but also also restraining different parts of the body like it could be soft tissues or the muscles or the bones itself then the idea here is to, if you could see, we could set up one more time this is the structure of a, a man right here, it could be riding in a horse or it could be also performed in different circumstances like a warrior trying to attack us but we will see here it's with the hook we will maybe restrain it here from here that it will see you will see that it's here close to the spine it could attack the nerves we could also restrain from here in the worst of the situations that you could be only hooking you could be you will only restrain the clothes but as you could see the clothes are restraining because in this kind of, of clothes, uh, they are strong and also could avoid you to draw. Then, when we are restraining from here, what we could do, of course, is to move in in order to avoid any kind of uh, draw with the, of, with the weapon that he could be carrying, like the sword, like the tanto, the knife, etc. We could also apply it not only from uh, Yoko Shari, but also on Ueno Shari, I mean, from this circumstance, in order that from here the hook will be passing around and restraining maybe the clothes here, or the maybe if he is trying to take out the sole from here, he could uh, hook here, he could restrain this area that is close to the to the, to the tendons of the shoulder and the biceps are right here and after that of course that we have this control from here we could block like on any kind of Hayanawa or in this kind of Nawano we call blocking and having control right here in order to perform the part of Shibaru the part of uh, restriction with the rope but the idea is to show here, right here in this video, how violent is the, the usage, of the use of this hook that it could be uh, hooking, it could be uh, attacking to different parts of the body or the clothes itself, and they are very, very effective. Then, this is another use of this kind of hook, and also with the rope that it could be the Kaginawa that we have been showing in prior videos. Thank you very much. I hope that you have enjoyed this explanation and this video. Keep watching our channel and see you on next time. Thank you very much. Goodbye.